Hydrate practice part four. When CaSO4 with some number of water molecules is heated, all of the water is driven off. If 34 grams of CaSO4, which has a molar mass of 136 grams per mole, is formed from 43 grams of the hydrated CaSO4, what is the value of X? There's a number of different pieces of information that they give us here. The first is the 34 grams of the CaSO4. That is our anhydrous salt. And then the molar mass is the mass of one mole of CaSO4. This is formed from 43 grams of our hydrated CaSO4. So the 43 grams of hydrated CaSO4 represents our hydrate. Let's write down our given information. Our hydrate is 43 grams. Our anhydrate is 34 grams. What we need to do here is take the difference between the two. And when we take the difference between the two, we find that we have nine grams left over. So if our hydrate is 43 grams and our anhydrate is 34 grams, that means that this nine grams right here represents the mass of our water. The first thing that we want to do here is take this mass of water and convert it into moles. Nine grams of water. We know that the gram formula mass of water is 18. 18 grams of H2O is equal to one mole of H2O. And of course, what I want to do here is make sure that my grams cancel my grams. So when I work this out, nine times one divided by 18 gives me 0 0.5 moles of water. The next thing that I want to do is to record the 34 grams of anhydrous salt. 34 grams of anhydrous salt, which in this case is CaSO4. Now in the problem, they tell me that the molar mass of CaSO4 is 136 grams. That means that 136 grams CaSO4 is equal to one mole of CaSO4. I want to make sure that my units cancel. Grams cancel grams. And when I work this out, I find my answer to be 0 0.25 moles of CaSO4. Finally, my last step is to take the moles of the water and divide that by the moles of my salt, which again, in this case, is CaSO4. So the moles of water is 0 0.5 moles of H2O. I'm going to divide that by 0 0.25 moles of CaSO4. And when I do this calculation, I find my answer to be two. So this two right here represents this X up here. My final formula is CaSO4 dot 2H2O. That is the formula for CaSO4 dihydrate.